Hey everybody, this is Jason Foreman, local real estate agent in Los Angeles with Compass. I'm gonna practice my expired script. There's an expired in Mar Vista, local neighborhood that I'm going to hit. It's a three bedroom, two bath for about $1.5 million. It's in pretty good shape. It's a big lot for that area in Los Angeles, 7,000 square foot lot. There's no reason they shouldn't have gotten $1.5 million. So I'm going to go and reach out to those people. Of course, among other expireds too. Okay, so I'm gonna practice my expired script. First time without the script, and second time with the script. And see if you guys, and I'm going to check this too, what did I miss? I'm getting pretty good, but usually I miss one or two questions. All right, so here we go without the script. Knock, knock, knock. Hi, my name is Jason. I'm a local realtor. I'm not selling anything. The reason that I dropped by, I was gonna ask this question before I get going. I, I saw that your home was on the market for sale and it was taken off. My only question for you is, what can I do to help you? And then they might say something like, we're not looking to sell it anymore. We've talked to a bunch of realtors and this is getting overwhelming. Okay, no worries. You guys are not looking to sell it anymore. I understand. Real quick before I go, had the home sold, where did you guys plan on moving to next? Oh, Nevada. Oh, okay, great. What's out there in Nevada? Awesome. Sure. Wow, okay, so was this a retirement move or is this a business move? So maybe it was a retirement move, and um, once you know the last, their once their youngest kid graduated college, and then they reached a certain age, they're going to move out so they can collect their pension. Okay, great. <clears throat> now, a couple quick questions before I get out of here. I'm almost done. <clears throat> now, what time frame did you guys have to sell this home? Awesome. Maybe in the next year or so. Oh, okay, I see. I see. Did you guys get any offers? Wow. Now, how did this experience go? Did it go how you had expected it to? Oh, wow, I see. So maybe things went good, maybe things went bad. Maybe they're not sure if they even want to sell it anymore. Okay, a couple more questions before I leave. How did you guys pick the real estate agent that you used to help you sell the home? Awesome. And did they mention maybe what was keeping the home from selling? No, oh, they said we priced it too high or the market's too low or something. Really? They said the market is not strong. Did you know this is one of the strongest markets for sellers that we've seen in almost over eight years? Yeah. And you know, one thing is I saw this home was on the market for more than 60 days. Well, that would be another situation. And it raised a little red flag because it raised a red flag for me because homes on this street and in this whole neighborhood in 90066, they fly right off the shelves. I was just a little concerned because usually homes sell for over a million dollars very quickly. Did you know that? Wow. Okay. Well, I'm about to get out of here. My name is Jason. Nice to meet you. What's yours? Joan. Joan. Well, thank you so much. Now, how did you guys meet the realtor that you spoke to that helped you sell the home? All right. And um, is there anything that they did that you really liked or did the experience go not how you guys wanted it to go? Awesome. <clears throat> okay. Well, it's nice to meet you, Joan. Last question before I get out of here. If we could, <clears throat> if, what if I told you we could sell your home in 30 days or less and get you the price that you want? Would that be okay with you? Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Why don't we do this? Let's pick up and let's, let's meet up this time next. Let's meet up on Monday. Uh, what's better for you, the afternoon or the evening? Uh, the morning or the evening? Okay. Yeah, and I would suggest that your husband is present too. Are there any other decision makers that need to be present aside from your husband? Okay, so the Monday. Uh, so did you say the morning or the afternoon is better for you? Okay, afternoon. I've got 12 p.m. and I've got 2 p.m. Which is better? Okay, I'll pencil you guys in for Monday 2 p.m. And then I'm going to show you... If we could be on, this is a little out of order. I, I skipped this one, but what would you say if beyond a reasonable doubt, I could get your home sold at, at the price that you wanted and get you a much better experience than you had before so you guys can get on with your life and get on to the next stage of your life in Nevada. Would that work for you? There we go, and then set the appointment. All right, I'll text you the day before to remind you. Okay, so I already know I missed a couple. I got pretty close there. Uh, at least the, the main conversation that needed to happen pretty much happened. Now I'm going to go straight off the script, cheating, reading the script. 
Hi, my name is Jason. I'm a local realtor, not selling anything. Before I get going, a uh, real quick question. I was dropping by, you know that your home was put on the market for sale. I saw it was taken off the market, and as a real estate professional, I'm just curious, how can I help you today? Awesome, great. Uh, I have a couple quick questions before I go. Now, had your home sold, where did you guys plan on moving to next? Oh, wow, now did this experience go how you had expected it to do? Awesome, a couple more questions, then I'm out of here. Was this a retirement move or, <clears throat> or, or a business move? Interesting, interesting. Now, what time frame were you guys looking to go to Arizona? Okay, okay. And just one or two more questions. Now, how did you guys pick the realtor that you guys used? Hmm. Did they mention what was keeping the home from selling? Did they do anything that you really liked? Maybe could pass that because they, they might, um, you know, not have anything at the time with the emotions running high, might not have anything like that to say. What would a really great, excellent, uh, what would a really great realtor do for you? Please describe. Okay, last question. Oh, I missed this one. Mo what motivation do you guys have to sell the home? On a scale of one to 10, how high is your motivation to still sell this home? All right, well, once again, my name is Jason. Pleasure to meet you. What is yours? Jen. Okay, thank you. Jen, here, why don't we do this? If I can sell, <clears throat> if you can sell your home in 30 days or less at the price you want, would that be okay with you? And the idea is, unless if they're not motivated, yes, of course they'll say yes. Okay, great, let's do this. I'll stop by, give a visit, and I'll show you what I can do for you, what me and my team can do for you. Get it sold in 30 days or less at the price that you need, so that way you could get on with your life and get on to the next stage in your life in Nevada and get you guys much better results than you had last time. Fair enough, right? All right, so then uh, Monday at 1 p.m., and then what's your best information, what's your best number, I'll text you my information. There we go. All right, I almost had it and missed a couple. All right, wish me luck, guys.